Hi, my name is Anna Tonicliffe and I sail women's match racing. Um, I haven't made the decision for the Olympics for 2012. I'm definitely going uh, to try and win another gold medal. And uh, whichever decision I make, either it be laser radial or match racing, I'll make my decision soon. Um, but as of right now, I can't say one way or another. Uh, although I've got a long way to go and can still learn in the laser, you know, I put so much effort into sailing that boat for four years that I need some, a break from it almost. People think there'd be a lot of pressure on me for having won the gold medal, but for me, I won the gold medal and it was a regatta that I won and you know now I'm just doing my job again and going out and sailing and trying to bring in the results when I can. You know I really like match racing because I really enjoy hanging out with like the girls that I sail with. Um, like we're, we're, we're all a bunch of good friends and so just spending time together is different than what I'm used to in the laser. It's shorter racing, it's much closer racing. Um, you ha always have a chance to get back in it, um, but if you are doing badly, you know, the race is over in 15 minutes, so it's not the end of the world. And you don't dwell on it for an hour like you do in fleet racing. I started sailing when I was two years old, basically, when my parents had a boat, and uh, we grew up in England and uh, went cruising with them every summer. And so by the time I was old enough to sail my own boat, they put me in a boat and told me to learn how to sail. They didn't, didn't care if I raced, they just wanted me to know how to do it because that was something that they did. And so when I moved to America, I moved, joined a program at North Cape Yacht Club. And then in high school, I started running. I was on the cross country and track team. So my senior year, I had to decide whether I was gonna go to college for and compete in sailing or compete in running. And then just in college, it kind of all fell into place. I had a, it worked out perfectly. I had a fantastic senior team my freshman year, um, sailing under, you know, my teammates, uh, Debbie Capozzi and, uh, you know, Sally Barco, Brad Funk. And I uh, just, I learned so much that year and then they all left and it like opened up for me to get all this experience and had great coaching from, uh, you know, team coach Mitch Brindley. And, uh, and right after that, they changed the uh, Olympic single-handed boat from the Europe dinghy to the laser radial. And so it was perfect. It all worked out and here I am today.